and that the world don't revolve around him. <laughs> yeah. The creature was made subject to vanity because he's delivering us from those vain thoughts. Right. You see what I'm saying? So that we can worship him. We're being delivered from that. Yeah. You know, yeah. and I thought that was so pretty. And then when she said that, that the world don't revolve around them, it all came to me. God would say, "That's right, because you know what? The planets, those nine planets, revolve mm -hmm. around what? Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. He put it in the heavens. Mm -hmm. right. Those twenty-four elders are surrounding that what? Purple mm -hmm. column. Mm -hmm. It revolves around him." Mm -hmm. Not us, and that those vain thoughts mm -hmm. that we have in our mind as it came to me. All that's about me is about what that's I think. Right. 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 Got right. to go. Right. We got to be that's delivered right. from that all that corruption. That corrupt. Mm -hmm. We made that. Mm -hmm. Right. This is Romans eight twenty. For the creature was made subject to vanity. Right. Not willingly, not willingly, but by reason of him who have subject the same in hope. Mm -hmm. Because the creature itself also shall be delivered from the bondage of, from the bondage of corruption into right. the glorious liberty of the sons of right. Elohim. So you can see that that universal revelation as it came through him. Mm -hmm. Standing there with all that vain and the mm -hmm. mm -hmm. with all those vain thoughts in your head. Right. Right. You know. You got Allah, Allah, you got Buddha, you got Jehovah, you got yourself, right. you got your job, you got your bank. <laughs> that is tonight, uh, this afternoon's class. At this time, we're going to have Doxology by Dr. Brandon Walker. Now unto him that is able to keep you from falling and to present you faultless before the presence of his glory with exceeding joy. To the only wise Elohim, our Savior, through Yahshua the Messiah, our Sovereign, belong glory and majesty, dominion and power, both before all times, now and ever. Let's all say hallelujah.